Yehezkel, Ezekiel chapter 30. And the word of Yah came to me, saying, Son of man, prophesy and say, Thus said the Master Yah, Howl, woe to the day, for the day is near, even the day of Yah is near. It is the day of clouds, the time of the nations. The sword shall come upon Mitzrayim, and great anguish shall be in Cush, when the, rain, when the slain fall in Mitzrayim, and they take away her wealth, and her foundations are broken down. Cush, and Put, and Lud, and all the mixed people, and Kub, and the sons of the land of the covenant shall fall with them by the sword. Thus said Yah, those who lean on Mitzrayim shall fall, and the pride of her power shall come down. From Migdal to Savannah, those within her shall fall by the sword, declares the Master Yah. They shall be ruined amidst the wastelands, and her city shall be in the midst of the cities that are dried up. And they shall know that I am Yah, when I have set a fire in Mitzrayim, and all her helpers are crushed. On that day messengers shall go forth before me, in ships to make the complacent Cushites afraid, and great anguish shall come upon them, as on the day of Mitzrayim. For look, it is coming. Thus said the Master Yah, I shall cause the crowd of Mitzrayim to cease by the hand of Nebuchadnezzar, sovereign of Babel, he and his people with him. The ruthless ones of the nations are brought to destroy the land, and they shall draw their swords against Mitzrayim, and shall fill the land with the slain. And I shall make the rivers dry, and I shall sell the land into the hand of evil ones, and I shall lay the land waste, and all that is in it. By the hand of foreigners I, Yah, have spoken. Thus said the Master Yah, And I shall destroy the idols, and make an end of the images in Noph, and there shall no longer be a prince from the land of Mitzrayim, and I shall put fear in the land of Mitzrayim. And I shall make Pathros a waste, and I shall set fire to Soan, and I shall execute judgments in No. And I shall pour out my wrath on Sin, the stronghold of Mitzrayim, and I shall cut off the crowd of No. And I shall set a fire in Mitzrayim. Sin shall writhe in anguish. No is to be split open. And Noph has adversaries daily. The young men of Aven and Pibaseth shall fall by the sword, while these cities go into captivity. And in Tehaphinus, the day shall be darkened, when I shall shatter the yokes of Mitzrayim there. And the pride of her strength shall cease in her. A cloud shall cover her, and her daughters shall go into captivity. And I shall execute judgments on Mitzrayim, and they shall know that I am Yah. And it came to be in the eleventh year, in the first month, on the seventh of the new moon, that the word of Yah came to me, saying, Son of man, I have broken the arm of Pharaoh, sovereign of Mitzrayim, and see, it has not been bound up for healing, to put a bondage to bind it, to make it strong, to hold a sword. Therefore thus said the Master Yah, See, I am against Pharaoh, sovereign of Mitzrayim, and shall break his arms, both the strong one and the one that was broken, and shall make the sword fall out of his hand, and shall scatter the Mitzrites among the nations, and disperse them throughout the lands, and strengthen the arms of the sovereign of Babel, and I shall put my sword in his hand, and I shall break Pharaoh's arms, and he shall groan before him with the groanings of the slain before him. And I shall strengthen the arms of the sovereign of Babel, but the arms of Pharaoh shall fall, and they shall know that I am Yah, when I put my sword into the hand of the sovereign of Babel, and he shall stretch it out against the land of Mitzrayim. And I shall scatter the Mitzrites among the nations, and I shall disperse them throughout the land, and they shall know that I am Yah.